This exam application tutorial is on the topic of hormonal and nervous communication. The question for four marks, describe how an impulse can continue to travel along a nerve pathway when there is a gap between two nerve cells. So here's a nerve cell, here's another nerve cell, and there's a gap in between. This gap is called a synapse. So really what this question is asking, how do nervous messages move across a synapse? So firstly, an electrical impulse has to arrive at the axon terminal, the end of a nerve cell, this point here. And you can see that happening here. Then chemicals called neurotransmitters, or you can call them NT substances, are released into the synapse. And you can see that happening here. They then diffuse across the synapse. That's an important thing to remember because they're in high concentration on this side, low concentration on this side, so they move to the other side by diffusion, where they bond to receptor proteins on the next neuron. And you can see that happening here. And this will generate an electrical impulse in the next neuron. The question is only for four marks, so these are the four mark-worthy points. Electrical impulse arrives, neurotransmitters are released into the synapse, they diffuse across the synapse and bond to these protein receptors on the next neuron.